Hi everybody, so I did a review of this movie uh, roughly probably about 10, 11 months ago. Somewhere between 9 and 11 months. That sounded weird. Um, I used to absolutely despise this movie. And then I watched it last night with Into the Horrorverse, and he, he thoroughly enjoyed it the first time, and he still thoroughly enjoys it. He sees its problems. Um, it grew on me a little bit, but today we are re-reviewing. I haven't done a re-review in a long time. But we are re-reviewing Unsaid. Before we get in, uh, if you could like and subscribe, goes a long way. Also, because Monday, the podcast is returning. Yeah. Uh, the malignant episode that we recorded like two months ago is finally, it's ready to come out. Because I just didn't have a thumbnail for it. But that'll come out soon. But let's just, let's just talk about, uh, I almost said malignant. Let's talk about Unsane. Um... Let's get into my positives, because I, I have some positives. I think Claire Foy uh, gives a, a very, like, solid performance. There are some scenes where she's, like, she's n like she's chewing up the scene. There's other scenes where she's just giving a decent performance. Uh, Jay Favreau, he's in this movie for a good, like, 40 minutes before they, for some reason, kill him off halfway through. Um, he's good. Uh, they, they actually, they have good chemistry. Um, I think some of the shots are decent, because this entire thing was shot on an iPhone. Like, the thing I'm currently recording on shot this movie. Like, they shot it on an iPhone 7. Um, some of the gore, you get a, occasional gore. It's, it's, it's decent gore. Um, and that, that's all I have to say positive about this. Now let's get into my many, many negatives. Um... Claire Foy, Jay Favreau, they were having good chemistry. I'm like, okay, this movie's on the up again, because I went into it with an open mind this time. And then they, like, kill him off, like, and there's still, like, 30-something minutes of movie left. And I was like, just wasted potential. The villain, I think his name's David, uh, kind of, of a forgettable villain. Um, also, they don't explain why they really put Sawyer in here. Apparently, something like the insurance company. Whatever, it's like, yeah, we'll put her in there for a week. Um, this movie has a lot of pacing issues, like, that I've noticed. Like, some moments it's, like, like very cool. Like, there's, like, a like pretty decent moment. And then it's just, like, 20 minutes of just, like, nothing. Um, her mom is a wasted, wasted character in this movie. Like, she's in, like, her mom, who I think the actress is actually doing a very decent job. Uh... They kill her off screen, then her body just pops up in the third act. Um, how I said some shots look good. Some shots just look very bad. You can tell it was shot on an iPhone. But you get just, you just get like annoying characters, and it just this movie just aggravates me because it has potential to be very very good. And then it just, it just, it doesn't live up. Um, but yeah, what I give Unsane out of five, I give it a 1.5. This is a bad movie, but there's a little bit of enjoyment in there. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I'm not going to record anything until like Tuesday, so Monday will be the podcast. And then Tuesday will be uh, another ranking no, I mean, Wednesday or Friday will be another ranking, but I, I'm, I'm enjoying being consistent. Uh, and yeah, I'll see you on the next one. Uh, peace out.